Hello, good evening. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. How are you today? Hi. All right, great. Good evening. Let's say good evening. Amy Michelle, how are you today? I'm fine. All right, excellent. How was your day? Uh, my name is Ailey Mitchell. Oh, how was your day? Uh, how was your day? ¿Qué tal su día? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, fine. Okay, nice. Did you have to work today? Uh, no trabajo. Oh, okay. You don't work. All right. That's fine. It's nice to meet you, Amy. It's nice to meet you, teacher. Thank you. Ana del Carmen, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Fine. Great. And how was your day? Nervous. <laughs> oh, you're nervous? Yeah. No, relax. <laughs> Everything is fine. <laughs> teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, but I'll be I'll be nice to you, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so how was your day? What did you? How was your day? ¿Qué tal su día? How was your day? Mm, fine. Okay. Right. Did you have to work today? Yes. You did. Okay. What do you do? Um, um it, I work in the school. Oh, okay. You work at a school. All right. Interesting. It's nice to meet you. Thanks. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Thank you. Estela, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How's everything? How are you? I'm very good. And you? I'm fine. Thanks. And how was your day? Mm, nice. Okay, great. Did you have to work as well? Yes. You did. What do you do? I'm secretary. You're a secretary. Okay, that's nice. Thank you. It's nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you, teacher. Thank you. Carlos Polanco, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? Yes. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Great. Great. I'm fine. And, uh, oh. Yes, tell me. Okay, and how was your day? Uh, very, very hard. Oh. <laughs> very, very hard. Day. Yes. Uh, in this moment, I, I'm very tired. Oh, yeah. Uh, I bet. <laughs> I, I need. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Okay, but you're almost done. Only one hour for the English class and then we go to rest. <laughs> the rest yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's nice okay. to meet you, Carlos. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Marvel Pineda. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Fine. Okay, excellent. How was your day? Um, very good. It was good. All right, I'm glad to hear that. It's nice to meet you, Marvel. Nice to meet you. Thanks. Um, Let me see, Diana Jamilet. Um, Diana Jamilet, good evening. 
Good evening. How are you today? I'm fine. Great. And how was your day? Diana, how was nice. your day? Okay. Nice. Perfect. All right. It's a pleasure, Diana. And let me see. Flora Esmeralda, good evening. Good evening, teacher and everybody. How are you today, Flor? Very good. Great. And, and how was your day? Excuse me? How was your day? ¿Qué tal su día? How was your day? Very good, teacher. Okay. I'm glad to hear that. It's nice to meet you. Let me see. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Lina, good evening. Okay, Emma, good evening. Good evening. How are you today? I'm fine. Great. And how was your day? So, so? How was it? Was it good? So, so? Maybe bad so, or just okay? Mm -hmm. Maybe bad. Little bit oh, it was a bad. bad one. Oh no, I'm sorry about that. Oh, okay. so I'm glad to have you here. Great for the English class, right? Yes. Okay, great. And let me see, Diana Lisette. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you, Diana? Nervous. You're nervous? Okay. <laughs> There's no reason to be nervous. nervous. <laughs> Relax. <laughs> okay, it's nice to meet you. Very good. Great. Anderson Garcia, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? Well, uh, a little tired by the oh. classes. Oh, do you study? Yes. Okay, what do you study? Uh, civil engineering. Oh, interesting, that's nice. Okay, did you have a good day though? Uh, yes. All right. Oh, so. Okay, that's fine. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Gabriela Teresón. Good evening. How are you today, Gabriela? I was tired because I work uh, all day from 6 a.m. to 8 p.m. Oh, a very long shift. Okay. Yes. All right. It's nice to meet you, Gabriela. Nice to meet you, teacher. Thank you. Araceli, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? Fine, thank you. It was mm -hmm. a little bit uh, moving. Oh, okay. In the morning, I went with my father-in-law to the doctor. Okay. And I am taking care of our, well, well, I am taking care of four little kittens. Oh, okay. You're taking care of kids. Yes. All right. Four little kids. They <laughs> were born yesterday. Oh, really? Oh my God! Really? They're just newborn. Oh, that is yes, cute, but yes. really demanding. <laughs> baby, baby, baby kids. Oh, yes. that's nice. Thank okay, you. it's a pleasure to meet you, Araceli. <laughs> Thank you. And let me see, Estela Morales. Good evening. 
Good evening, Miss. How are you today, Araceli? I mean, Estela, sorry. <laughs> um, I'm fine, teacher. Okay, great. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Miss. Thank you. Let me see who's missing. Hey, Alejandro Francia. Good evening. Alejandro, good evening. Okay, how about Cecilia Estrada? Good evening, Cecilia. Hello, good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, but a little tired from work. Okay, you had a busy day. Yes. All right. So I'm glad to have you here. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Diana Listet, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Nervous. Nervous? <laughs> <laughs> Why? Because of the new teacher. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, don't worry. Everything will be fine. <laughs> It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Charlie, good evening. Good evening. How are you today? I'm fine, thanks. Very well, I'm glad to hear you. It's nice to meet you. Thanks, same to you. Thank you. Vladimir Tolentino, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How's everything? Um, I, I'm so nervous, teacher. <laughs> really? <laughs> <We're> Relax. <talking. laughs> um, I, I haven't practiced oh. even from a, a lot of years ago. <laughs> oh, okay. So you're new to this program? Uh, yes. 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 Okay. yes. Okay. All right, don't worry. You'll see it's easy and it's very, very smooth, very nice. Okay, so, thanks. Yeah. Don't worry about it. <laughs> nice to meet you, Vladimir. Thank you. And let me see who's missing. Boris Rodriguez, good evening. Good evening. How are you today? So, so. So, so, uh, really? Yeah. Oh. Um, I'm late. Oh, okay, but don't worry. It's our first class, so it's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay. It's nice to meet you, buddies. And nice to meet you, too. Okay, I think I have said hi to the most of you, at least. And I'll get to know you little by little. So let's start with our class. Um. Let me share my presentation first. Okay, let me welcome everybody to our program, English, uh, English Online. And this is um, the, the pre-intermediate one course, the course of play intermedio uno. And about myself, I have uh, said hi to you, but I didn't say my name. Sorry about that. So let me tell you. My name is Liliana Mendoza Axume. And what can I tell you? I'm from Santa Ana. I have been working with these courses for a couple of months. And I really like them. So I, I enjoy these classes a lot. And I'm here to help you with anything you need. Just please let me know whenever you need to. You need my help or if you need anything from me, just tell me, please. I'm here to help. And um, let me remind you about the class requirements. Um, well, first, we have to register in each of the sessions using our full names. Remember, you have to use the name that appears in your DUI, in your ID. And so please everybody keep that into account. Recordemos siempre registrarnos con el nombre, eh, con nuestro nombre completo, el nombre que aparece en nuestro DUI. 
para cuestiones de, de asistencia, ¿verdad? Y también porque a veces se nos da la situación de que coinciden algunos nombres, entonces la única forma de diferenciarles es con el nombre completo. Así que les pedimos, por favor, tener ese cuidado. Y también, eh, si por alguna razón entran con un nombre que, que no era, de repente aparece incluso el nombre del celular, Huawei, o Samsung, o something hay que tener el cuidado de revisar y de cambiarlo en el momento para que podamos entendernos igual y comunicarnos en, en todo momento. Then remember that the use of microphone and video camera is, um, is re recommendable. So please, I ask you to keep your camera on so we keep on seeing each other and our interaction is better. And um, bueno, con el uso de la videocámara, eh, lo mejor sería que la tengamos encendida en la mayor parte del tiempo para que así nos estemos viendo y la interacción sea un poquito mejor, ¿verdad? Si estamos viendo la, a la persona con la que estamos hablando o las personas con las que nos estamos comunicando y pues nos sentimos un poco más cómodos, podría ser. And also about the microphone, remember to keep it off unless you are using it, of course. El micrófono, recordemos siempre tenerlo apagado a menos que lo estemos utilizando. Desde luego, habrán momentos en los que estamos participando y pues no hay ningún problema. Tenemos el micrófono encendido. Igual en cualquier momento, cuando necesite hacer alguna consulta, eh, enciende su micrófono y pues me dice, me dice su, su pregunta, su duda. No hay problema con eso, pero sí les voy a pedir que mantengamos los micrófonos apagados en los momentos donde no estemos participando para que podamos entendernos bien, porque eso a veces nos genera el feedback o de pronto hay tal vez algún ruidito ahí en, en casa, es que son cositas que no podemos controlar, ¿verdad? Entonces eso es lo más recomendable, tener el micrófono apagado, excepto en los momentos donde estamos participando. Then, let me ask you about the registration at the English Corporativo Platform. I saw some messages from you. Um, well, some people were having trouble, so let me ask you about that. How are you doing with the platform? Um, no sé cómo vamos con la plataforma. Lograron entrar todos. Tenemos alguna consulta, alguna duda? No, teacher. Um, yeah, I don't have any questions. Yo sí, yo, yo ya avisé, me dijeron de que mañana a las 4 de la tarde, porque parece que Hice muchos intentos, entonces se me bloqueó la plataforma. Me dijeron que mañana a las 4 me lo van a habilitar para que yo lo vuelva a intentar. Muy bien, estamos pendientes entonces. Igual ya le están sí. brindando apoyo técnico, me parece bien. Sí, gracias. Ok, ¿los demás lograron registrarse? Yes, teacher. Muy bien. Yes, teacher. Okay, yes. excelente. Y no sé si yes, ya, ya empezamos a trabajar o cómo vamos. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. We have started. Yes, yes, nice. Yes. Okay, yes, excellent. Yes. You're a great student. Okay. Thank so, you. So remember that the, the use of the platform is very important. You have to do your best to complete the lessons because that is a, what you're going to be graded for. Or a, that is the thing that decides if you pass or or if you approve the course, right? So please keep on working in the platform that is really essential for this course. Recordemos que el trabajo en plataforma es lo que más cuenta para este curso. Así que hay que, hay que ir avanzando, ¿verdad? Tanto como podamos, usted avanza según su tiempo, según su disponibilidad. No hay problema con adelantarse ni nada de eso. Al contrario, si usted en esta semana logra completar, that will be perfect. O si no, pues igual ir llevando al menos el, el avance pues, semanal que esperamos, que es de eh, la sesión, las secciones de la 1 a la 3, las estaríamos trabajando en las primeras dos semanas. Y luego a la semana 3 corresponde la sección número 4 a la semana Cuatro corresponde la sección 5, así que ese sería el mínimo avance que estaríamos esperando en la plataforma. Por favor, les pido que vayamos todos al día para que luego no nos toque estar en la última semana, eh, estar muy saturado, ¿verdad? Con tanto trabajo en la plataforma. Lo mejor es ir avanzando poco a poco. 
And let me remind you that these classes are recorded and the videos are going to be published each day in YouTube. And we have a, our own uh, list, our own list for this class. I'm going to send you the link tomorrow. So you have it in any case you want to check something or if you miss one of the classes and then you want to check the video, it will be available there in the list. Igual, recordar que estas clases siempre quedan grabadas. Ahí tenemos los videos en una lista de reproducción en YouTube. El día de mañana yo les estaría compartiendo el link, que bueno, igual ya se los han compartido a ustedes en la información del curso, pero por cualquier cosa, pues yo se los vuelvo a compartir para que si necesitan revisar alguna parte de la clase o de pronto han perdido alguna clase y quieren pues el siguiente día verla para ponerse al día, estarán por ahí. And sure. tell me. Okay, uh, I have a question. Okay. Well, my name is Dan Daniel Alberto Gomez. Okay, Daniel. Getting to, and I get into this course uh, with another email because my email uh, I had a I had a pro I had a trouble. So okay. Uh, yeah. Do you, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Ah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, uh, so uh, today I was, uh, I recorded my, my problem, but I'm still receive an answer, an answer. Oh, okay. So don't worry, I guess you'll get some help tomorrow. It's because um, today it was a busy day, you know, many courses are starting at the same time. So we have many different Many different people just they like, having trouble with different things and all that. So um, um, I guess they are going to help you tomorrow. And there's no problem with uh, with registering in the in the classes with another email. There's no trouble with that. And um, just with your name, be careful, please, because it appears as Lina. That is what I see. So please try to change it. Okay. Uh, so, Lo... Yeah, yeah. Daniel, Daniel Alberto Gomez. Daniel Alberto. That is my name. Okay. So that's if... why they... Yeah, yeah. Oh no, don't worry about the email to enter to the sessions. The important thing is the email that you use to go to the platform. That one is really essential. Okay. Because okay, remember that you. we're going to keep track on your advance in the platform. So uh, you should keep just one email there. Then in the classes, there is no problem. You can just register with any email. And as far as you write your name, that will be fine. Ah, OK. Thank you, teacher. All right. All right. I, I understand. OK, thanks, Daniel. And let's see. Uh, I was going to show you the platform. I think that the most of you have worked with this. Is there any new student to this course? Tengo algún estudiante que sea nuevo para este curso? I am beginning. This is the first time. Oh, this is the first time you are in the English online. Okay. So let me show you the, a little bit of the platform. So this is our pre-intermedio modulo uno platform. We have five, uh, five different sections. So as I mentioned before, we are going to be working the first three sections in the in the first two weeks of the course. Las primeras tres secciones las desarrollamos en, el, en las primeras dos semanas del curso. Y también es importante recalcar que acá al final de la tercera sección hay un examencito, the midterm test. This midterm exam has to be done by the end of the next week. So you should develop it, um, what, on Thursday or Friday, the most. El examen debe realizarse, bueno, toda la sección esta, uno, dos y tres, incluyendo el examen, deberían de estar completos el, la próxima semana al final, como eso de jueves, viernes, ya deberíamos okay. de estar por esta parte. And then for week number four, we develop section number, week number three, sorry. So it's for week mm -hmm. number three, we develop section number four, 
And then for the last week, week number four, we work on section five. And it's also important to remember that we have a final exam um, at the end of the section number five. And that one has to be done, um, let's see, the last Wednesday of classes. En esta modalidad ahora nos piden que tengamos el final exam hecho, completado el día miércoles antes de finalizar el curso. Entonces tendríamos clase aún el jueves, pero aún así necesitamos tener completo el trabajo en plataforma el día miércoles. Yo les estaría recordando igual ya en la última semana para día miércoles tendríamos que haber finalizado hasta esta parte. And uh, I don't know if you have checked the platform. We have. I have problems. I have to wait oh, okay. until tomorrow about four o'clock. Okay. In the afternoon. Okay, so let me show um, you a little bit about it. So it starts here. We have some videos. Um, some of them are conversations, some others are explanations of the different topics. For example, here we have a conversation, we listen to it. Then we have a discussion forum. So at the end of the video, you get a, a topic or you get a task to participate here in the discussion forum. You just write your answer. And here we have the participations. Then you go to the next section. And here we have the lesson objective. Then we have a video that explains statements with be and possessive adjectives. Here we have the explanation. We got another discussion forum where you have to participate. Then we get the knowledge checks. Remember that the knowledge checks are really important because those are the ones that, um, that make a score, that make up the score uh, for you to approve the course. So you should be uh, completing this, this, the knowledge checks, this exercises. There are some different this kinds is. of exercises. And yes, for example, here you have to complete the sentences by choosing the correct word. And then we have some fill in the blanks. We have different kinds of exercises. And let me also remind you that it's really important to be careful with the punctuation and capitalization and also with the spaces within the words. Hay que tener mucho cuidado al trabajar en plataforma, okay. más que todo cuando tenemos que escribir algo or typing, right? Hay que no se puede dejar espacio, doble espacio, ni un espacio antes de escribir, ni después de escribir, porque eso marcaría las respuestas como incorrectas. So please be careful with that. And also capitalization, las Las letras mayúsculas igual cuentan y eh, yeah, la puntuación también y a veces si agregamos un puntito, por ejemplo, al final de la palabra, nos podría marcar como incorrecto. Eh, another important thing about the platform is that you can do the exercises as many times as you, as you want. So it doesn't matter if at first you do not get 100, you can do the exercise over and over until you get 100, or you get the score you feel comfortable with. Recordar que los ejercicios en plataforma se pueden realizar tantas veces como deseen. Eh, si al principio no obtuvo el, el 100% o el 10, igual puede volver a hacerlo una, dos veces, tres veces, cuantas veces necesite, hasta que obtenga el puntaje con el que usted se sienta cómodo. Y también el puntaje de aprobación es del 80%, ¿verdad? Así que hay, que hay que tener mucho cuidado con eso, de no quedarnos abajo de, de ese 80% para poder aprobar nuestro curso. Ok, do we have any questions so far? No questions? So far so good? Ok, fine. So let me tell you about today's lesson objective. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to understand and use possessive adjectives my, your, his, her, its, our, and their, in order to introduce their names and to express possessions. So let's start with a short reading. And um, let me read it for you, and then I'll ask for some volunteers to read it again. 
that goes like, hello, my name is Jack and this is my family. I have a sister, her name is Sarah. I have two brothers, their names are Gabe and Ryan. My parents are called Ted and Sandra. We live together in our big house. It's very nice. Also, I have four grandparents. My dad's dad is called George and he's married with Granny Lucy. My mom's parents are Philip and Susan. I love my grandparents. Okay, let me ask for some volunteers to read, please. Me too. Okay, Araceli, go ahead. Hello, my name is Jack, and this is my family. I have a sister. Her name is Sarah. I have two brothers. Their names are Gabe and Ryan. My parents are Paul, Ted, and Sandra. We live together in our big house. It's very nice. Also, I have four grandparents. My dad's dad is called George, and she's married with Granny Lucy. My mom's parents are Philip and Susan. I love my grandparents. Okay, very good, Araceli. Thanks for reading. Thank you. Do I have any other volunteer to read? Me, teacher. Carlos. Okay, go ahead, Carlos. Thank you. Hello. Yeah. Hello, my name is Jack, and this is my family. I have a sister. Her name is Sarah. I have a two brothers. Their, their names are Gabe and Ryan. My parents are called Ted and Sandra. We live together in our big house. This is very nice. Also, I have four grandparents. My dad's dad is called George, and he is married with Granny Lucy. My mom's parents are Philip and Susan. I love my grandparents. Very well, Carlos. Thanks for reading. And do I have another volunteer? Me, teacher. Adriana. Go ahead, Adriana Imperatriz. Sorry. Hello, my name is Jack, and this is my family. I have a sister. Her name is Sarah. I have two brothers. Their names are Gay and Ryan. My parents are called Ted and Sandra. We live together in our big house. It's very nice. Also, I have four grandparents. My dad's dad is called George, and he's married with Granny Lucy. My mom's parents are Philip and Susan. I love my grandparents. Okay, very well, Adriana, thank you. And I heard somebody else wanted to read. Who was that? Me teacher. Vladimir, okay, go ahead. Uh, hello, my name is Jack and this is my family. I have a sister. Her name is Sarah. I have two brothers. Their names, their names are Gabe and Ryan. My parents are called Ted and Sandra. We live together in our big house. It's very nice. Also, I have four grandparents. My dad is my dad, that is called George, and he is married with Granny Lucy. Uh, my mom's parents are Philip and Susan. Hello, my grandparents. Okay, very well, Vladimir. Thanks for reading. Now, everybody, repeat, please. Family. 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 Brothers. Brothers. There. 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 Names. 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 Parents. 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 Cold. 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 Together. 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 Grandparents. Grandparents. Married. 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 
Married. Married. Married. Married. Married. Granny. Married. Granny. 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 Okay, very well. Now here in the reading we have some different um we have some different uh, possessive adjectives. Can you identify them? My my okay. um, my what else? Her, her, their her. Okay, our, we have here our, 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 their, their. Okay, there, 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 uh, let me see. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So that is the topic that we are going to study today. Uh, I think you have already reviewed them in the platform, maybe. So you should know them, right? Let's just review them. And then we are going to develop some practice. So let's see, the possessive adjectives. We use possessive adjectives to express possession. Here we have some examples on how to use them. This is my sister. My sister, I say. His pillow is soft. His. His, his, his. pillow is for his. him, right? Mm -hmm. he, yeah. His pillow. Then can somebody help me to read the next example, please? This is her phone number. Her. Thank this you. Next one. Your laptop is black. Your laptop is black. Your laptop, laptop is black. Next, next example. Or beer is beer noise. noise. Or beer is okay. Next one. Or beer is noise. Their house, house is beautiful. Is beautiful. Okay. Then we have. This is our car. That is our car. That is our car. That is. That is. Okay, next one. Color is brown. Is brown. Is brown. Is color is brown. Color. They are my workers. They are my co-workers. Our class is interesting. Our class is interesting. Then we have your notebook is on the chair. The chair. Notebook is on the chair. Next my one, my classmates. Classmates are nice. nice. Okay, next. Their brother is, is handsome. And the next one is. His name is Rocky. His name is Rocky. And I think that's the last one. Their pool is very big. Their pool is very big. Okay, so you see different examples on how to use the possessive adjectives. We have my sister, his pillow, her phone number, your laptop, our bird, their house, our car, its color, my co-workers, our class, your notebook, my classmates, her brother, its name, and their pool, right? So those are the possessive adjectives. And now let's remember how they go. Remember we have a different possessive adjective for each of the pronouns. For the pronouns we have I, you, he, you, it, we, you, and they. Okay. And now let's write the corresponding possessive adjectives. Let me get a different color. My. my for I we have my, my. for you your your for your for she yes for here for it it's it's we our your in there Okay. Good. So please everybody repeat. My 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 your your his hair it's 
our our your 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 their 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 Okay, now let's make some examples using the possessive adjective. Can you give me some sentences using possessives? Give me one using my. Car, my. my. My car is black. My car is black. Okay. Black. Another one using your. Your, your cell phone your is very is nice. Your cell phone is very nice. Okay, and then we have his. His dog is black. His dog is black. Perfect. Okay, another one using hair. Her face is beautiful. Her face is beautiful. Okay, now let's make one using its. His pencil is red. Its pencil is red, okay. Okay, then we have our. Our class is good. Our class is good, okay. Another one using your? Your at. Your? I'm sorry, mm -hmm. I went, uh, your. Your house is big. It just uh, Your house is your big. Your house is big. It's fine. Okay, and the last one using their. Their parents are. Their parents are. Friendly. What? Friendly. 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 Okay. Friendly. Thank you. Friendly. Their parents are friendly. There we go. So we use my car, your cell phone, his dog, her face, its pencil, our class, your house, and their parents. Very well. Okay, so that is what we have for the possessive adjectives. Now let's do some practice for this. I'm going to send you to the breakout rooms. So you work in groups. We have three different exercises. In exercise one, you have to write a possessive adjective that corresponds to each subject in parentheses. For example, here we have where is, and you have the subject I and my book. book. My, so you say my. my. Where, where is, is my, my book? book? And that is what you have to do in exercise one. Then in exercise two, you read and complete the sentences with the correct possessive adjective. We have, for example, that is my sister's husband. That is? What do we say here? That is my sister's hair. husband. That is her hair, husband. Hair. Hair. Exactly. We say her husband. And in exercise three, you have to write the corresponding possessive adjectives. And you read and you find the correct one. For example, in number one, two students didn't do. Their mathematics. It's exactly there. It corresponds to the two students their mathematics homework. Okay, so let me send you to the breakout rooms and I'm sending you pictures of the exercises to the WhatsApp group, okay? Okay. 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 Right, so here we go. Let's go to the breakout rooms and you're getting the exercises in just a minute.
Sancho. Y le da todo su nombre completo. 7789 0692 7789 0692 ¿Cómo se llama él? Sí. Yo lo tengo como Flor Sánchez, pero cuando me llamaron me llamó un muchacho, así que usted grábelo así, escríbalo. Okay. Yo estoy aquí, eh, disculpen, yo tengo aquí el grupo de WhatsApp, pero no me ha caído nada. A mí sí ya me cayó en el, en el grupo de WhatsApp. Uh, uh, Por cierto, vaya, el grupo de Instagram es Instagram Flor Sánchez Ajá. Sí, ese es, sí. Ajá. No me ha caído sí, pero, nada. Eh, fíjese que yo vi que cuando se apareció en la pantalla ya lo vi ya lo vi bajos en internet tenía esa señal cuando se apareció en la pantalla decía hubo un momento en que decía que usted tiene bajo el internet sí o sea que seguramente después le va a caer ahorita que usted está lo tengo cabaret frente se ven barritas rojas de repente que se le corta cuando se le ven amarillas y así como que el internet es inestable dice Ahorita le dice a Emma Aguilar. Uh, Pero sí, ya mandaron el WhatsApp. Las tres, los tres ejercicios. Y yo creo que la ticha no va a hacer hablar en inglés. Buena, vale. Y pensando que estuviera de unirse también. Pero es que está en clase. No hablo. Pero me hago. Pero puedo hablar. No, no. Ay, ya estoy. Hello, everybody. Did you get the exercises? ¿Recibieron los ejercicios? No, teacher. You didn't get no, teacher, them, Carlos. No, teacher, because I don't have a... Uh, because I don't have the, the, the... How do you say the... the, the email or the, eh, the... What do you mean? Internet. Uh, I, I don't know. Because, yes, I have an internet. Uh -huh. But, uh, but uh, my problem is the, I meeting the group uh, a few... Uh, Second one long. Oh, okay. You just joined. Okay, let me send them again. I'll send them again. No me voy a poder dormir tranquila. Okay, I just send him again, Carlos. Okay, I receive it in this moment. Thank you. Okay. A lot. No problem. Oh, what I said is gone. We have some trouble with the internet, maybe. Let's see. Okay, so remember that you can work together. You can share your answers, okay? Okay. All right, see you later. My husband.
That it's my husband. Yes. Number two. This shirt belongs to me. This is my shirt. This is my shirt. My, my. My. Number three. His. His. sister. His. Yeah. His. 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 Number three. Number three. Number three. That is Frank's sister. That is my. No, that is. No. This. That is Frank's sister. Sorry, number five. Number five. Number five. Number five. That's our, our neighbor. neighborhood. Plants. Plants. There is our neighbor's plant. It's. There is our plan. Uh, our plan, yeah. Our. Our. Number, number six. It's. This house does not belong to us. This is it's not our house. Our. Yeah, you know, this house it's, does not belong to us. This this is not it. It. Yo, no, che, check it out the sentences. This house does not belong to us. This house does not belong. Esta casa no nos pertenece. This isn't our house. Esta no es nuestra casa. This is not our our neighbor. Okay. Do you live in that house? No. Quiero ver. Este, ¿cuál va? La, la seis, ¿no? La seis. Uh -huh. This house, this house doesn't belong. Esa casa no nos pertenece. Entonces, esa casa is in uh, our, our, our house. Uh -huh. This is an our. This is an this, hour. This is an hour, our house. Mm, you live on, on, on the street. You live on the street. This is your? This is your street, yes. Uh, this is your street. This is your street. Mm -hmm. David and his brother live in the street. I see, but there is. Um, there. Um, there. There. Como su calle de ellos. Sube, su de ellos, sí, sí. sí, sí. This car belongs to my aunt, my aunt Selma. ¿Cuál sería en la en la en la ocho? That is here. There. Ese, ese peine pertenece a mi tía Selma. Es com. Mm, está diciendo como esta casa no nos pertenece porque as es de nosotros. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Entonces sería is, isn't our house. Uh, our, uh, esta no es nuestra casa. Exacto. This is on the street. You live on the street. This is my. This is my street. No. You live. You live. Your. Or, this is your. 
you, you live in on this building. This is your. This is. I don't know. You live on this street. This is. This is como tú vives en esta calle, verdad? Mm -hmm. This yeah. is, ajá. Uh -huh. This is your street. Your street. Mm -hmm. Esa es. Ah, okay. La ocho, David and his brother live on that street. Entonces, está hablando de que ellos viven en esa calle. That is their street. De ellos. Porque de ellos. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. David y sus hermanos. Y su hermano. Y ya habrán regresado. Ya habrán regresado a la clase. No, porque no, no creo que no, no, no hubieran estado. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. This one belongs um, to nueve. This one belongs to my aunt Selma. This is her comp. Aunt. Her. This is uh, no sé si es combo, pero dice como este combo pertenece a mi tía. Um, peine. El, el peine. Este peine pertenece a mi tía ah, Selma. Sí. Okay. Ah, uh -huh. this is her comp. Aquí sería this is her, ¿verdad? Sí. Her. Porque de ella. Mm -hmm. What is the meaning the comp? What? The comp, comp, uh, this comp. Um, Peine. 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 Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Dos. Okay, how did you do with the practice? Did you finish? No, 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 no. Yes, I think time wasn't enough, but don't worry about it. And um, did you get to exercise three at least? Or no? Did you get to exercise three? Llegaron al ejercicio tres? No. No. Okay, don't worry. So don't worry about it. Tomorrow I'll give you some time to work on exercise three then. Okay. Um, Okay. And we're going to okay. check exercise one and two as well. So that will be all for today's class. It was really nice to, to meet you all. I'll see you tomorrow. Take care, everybody. Have a good night. Okay. See you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Bye.